Hey everyone, my name is Daria Kosa and I am a fashion photographer based in Miami. I have a lot of experience like shooting in the studio and I decided that I should try to shoot something like with the lighting equipment outdoor. So I just got a new Broncolor kit for outdoor shooting and I'd like to do unboxing today to show you guys what we get there. <laughs> it's like a really huge pack. <laughs> like, much bigger than me. <laughs> so it's actually really heavy, like for me. So I'm trying to... <laughs> Almost there. <laughs> it's a really cool backpack. I feel like I could definitely travel with it. So we have like wheels here. We have like this side. So yeah. But I saw in the picture, so it, it's supposed to be like backpack. So I think this part, it will be like where you have those tapes, which you could put like here and then you can just adjust it for yourself so it's really cool because you could really travel with it somewhere like going whenever you need and bringing lighting with you i think i could definitely wear it <laughs> it will be funny part if i will go like this <laughs> when you wear it it's not like super heavy it's much easier than just handle it <laughs> we have like some kind of small bucket here I don't know what is here or what you can put here, but I would love to check it. It's like a very small one. So I think you can use it like for holding tripod. You know, let me try how it works because I'm not sure that it's what I'm thinking for. So let's just try together. Let's try to put tripod over there. It's really cool just like you buying lighting and getting like full backpack which you can use for multiple things. We have one more packet outside. It's like large one. Probably I would use this for memory cards, some cords. It's like going up until here. I think this one will be perfect for the water <laughs> and sandwich cookies. What we have here? Hmm. Another packet. It's really cool when you have a lot of packets, right? We will open like one larger packet and see what we have here. So I guess it will be a speed drink here. The drink will be used for soft box to set up, so we will see lately how easy it will be to set up. So it's really cool that speed drink also have their own package. I really like that everything has their own package, so many packets, like everything is super detailed. It truly really makes me feel it's a really high-end product. Truly, I don't really read instruction. I don't really love it too. I don't really like it to read. Sometimes I start reading and opening the instruction, but something going wrong. <laughs> Ooh. Here we have a soft box, which we need to build, like set up with this speed ring. This probably like small umbrella. 
Everything is also like packaging really cool. So that's look like something small with the cords, probably kind of battery. We will check it later. Maybe it's a charger. Could be, right? So, oh, that's a, that's a heavy one. I already have so much stuff here. And we have one more. Oh, I probably know what this is. <laughs> Like back in another bag. I just decided to move backpack for the side because we have already a lot of stuff here. So let's figure out what we have. This belt, I think we could use it for this another like smaller bag for power pack. Bye! <laughs> it's not heavy. Probably you can even like shooting like this. So let's see. I really upset like we have so many like bags and packages. I like whenever it's so. And we have one more belt. Let's see. <laughs> Is it not wonderful? <laughs> Maybe this one is supposed to go for this bag. Yep. Yep. Okay. First time ever taking it out. <laughs> so that's like the most interesting part. It's power pack. That's for outdoor. It's with the battery pack. So you could use it with whenever you want. Two outlets distribute 1200 watts. With this pack you could use two heads, which is really cool. What I really like about brown color, that you could get like super fast recycling time. It allows you to run modeling lighting up to two hours, more than 200 flashes on the full power, So, it's actually like really heavy. I think it's kind of, I mean, half less than this one, but still for this small thing, it's a lot. So I guess it's going like this way. And I think it just like popping there. Oh. <laughs> one second. Yeah, got it. And probably to just get out, you just need to push this button up. Yeah. Oh, that was easy. Yeah. Cool. I think you could just buy several extra batteries. So you could use this battery pack for a longer time. And you, or for example, like when you're using one battery, other one could charge at that time. And then you just switch. You probably don't need to take this battery pack out of the bag always. You could actually leave it there. Let me put it back and let's see how it's work. Oh my God. So we have here like ventilation, like it could allow battery pack to cool in. Um, this side it's look like it's opening so you could get Take out the battery, put it again back, yeah. And like other side, which allows you to get an access for the outlet. Yeah. So with this transmitter, you can actually put all settings right there. And just, you don't need to get access for the battery pack. So let's see how the head looks like. Yeah, <laughs> beautiful, perfect, brown color, mobile LED lamp. What I really like about brown color, they have really cool modifiers. So this one is the regular reflector. I would say this pretty small. I really love this ergonomic shape. It's not heavy at all. I would say you could definitely even like your assistant could just hold the lamp. You don't really need a stand. 
<laughs> and just I really love the style like this dark gray with blue elements it looks very stylish it's actually long enough uh, usually when I'm shooting in the studio for me it's enough to use like this one but in case if I need to go somewhere like for more distance and probably for outdoor, I was using an extension cord. Yeah, I got some cables here. Woo! One, two, three different cables and one extra outlet. It's outlet, right? I finally found the cable for charger. So let's use it. Red one, it just trigger. It just probably if you don't have transmitter you can use this one but I would definitely suggest you to use transmitter and those one I think it just like if you would love to use one of LED lamp like continuous light you can just yep like go on like this and put it right in the battery pack Don't use this one anymore and right now we will build like set up soft box and see umbrella so we will start with the easy part umbrella silver umbrella 84 centimeters it's like small one I think this size is perfect for traveling. Usually when I use lighting with umbrella, I prefer to leave this classic reflector on and just put an umbrella on top. Like this thing. Pretty easy. Let me see how hard it will be for me to build soft box. I have never done it before actually. Oh wow, that's cute. <laughs> so that's a sub box. Okay, I guess like those things should go in black spots. I will start with this one. The last one is usually like the hardest part. <laughs> yep, we got it. Cool. One more diffuser going on top. Ooh. Okay, so we set it. It's soft box 60 to 60. I think it's like perfect size for outdoor shootings, uh, especially when you have like wind and whenever a lot of things going on around you. This one is like perfect one. For the studio, I really like to use larger ones like uh, like parabolic umbrella 222 and octabox 150. But this one, I think it's like perfect one for outdoor. Let's change modifier. Again, you just like pushing it, switch. And you just like easily set, set it up. And so the first thing you should do, like put in like upper thing first, and then just like click it. <laughs> we just like put in upper thing first, just like click it turn it on so we have power of two the battery is charged like almost more than the half uh, let's see the model and lighting if it's working just pushing the button mod yeah 
it is. I hope you see it. Yeah, we could go to, right now it was standing on three power. We could go, I feel, up to nine. No, 10. Yeah, 10, ten is the maximum power. Let's do it. Push. <laughs> Overall, I would say I really love this brown color kit and I can't wait to test it on real set and show you all the features which it has. So if you like this video, please give me a like, subscribe and see you in the next video. <laughs>